Hello and welcome to this new Football Manager 2019 experiment. In this experiment, I am putting the four best players on Football Manager into one team. Now what that means is, is one is going to be the goalkeeper, two will be a defender, uh, three will be a midfielder and four will be a striker. Now, the team I've chosen for this is Everton. Now the reason for this is Everton are always a team that are up one year and down the next. And I think their last major success was the FA Cup final in 94, 95, I think. So what I want to do is give them a chance to re-establish themselves uh, as the team that they once were in the 70s and 80s uh, by giving them the four best players on Football Manager. So who are the best players? So this is to do with, obviously, value. They are the most valuable players. So newer will be going to, to, to Everton. Uh, we will put in, um, what should we do here? Do, 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 it's competent at, no, we don't want to do that. All defenders, there you go. So, the most valued defender is Van Dijk and Alaba, Alaba, Alaba of FC Bayern and Liverpool. So that's a bit dodgy. That mm. now Van Dyke can only play three positions. Alaba can play all them positions. So what we'll do is we'll put Alaba in the Everton squad. Let's go to uh, all midfielders, and then obviously Neymar, ninety-four million. He will go into the Everton squad, and let's go to strikers. Again, Neymar is there, but uh, obviously we've already got him in the midfield. Uh, again, Messi is known as a midfielder, but again, he is a striker. So as he is second on that list, we will put Messi in the Everton squad. So let me move them over to uh, Everton. Uh, I'll come back and then we will, what we will do is we'll go. Uh, we'll look at the Everton squad uh, and see them players uh, actually... Uh, signed up to the team and ready for the season. Here we go Lionel Messi, Neymar, Manuel Neuer, and David Alaba are now at uh, Everton Football Club. Neymar seems to have lost um, some a value of a million on there as well, which is a bit odd. Perhaps it's because he went to Everton. But anyway, all four players are there. You've got a goalkeeper, defender, striker, two strikers, two midfielders. Technically, Neymar can play in both positions, and so can messy so let's go to the premier division and let's see if that makes any difference on the season preview so not really in their top uh 11 squad they've got newer uh alaba neymar and messi both in midfield there uh, that is their projected lineup of course so what we are going to do we're going to go ahead a year in the Premier League and see if they can obviously beat that seventh position and see if it makes any of Everton any better uh, as a team uh, as such. Um, just just to see if that makes any difference to the team, to the players, to their money, to, to anything really. Because if you go to Everton and go to the editor, go to the club details, uh, their reputation is 7,000, you know, 39,000 club attendance. Again, Will it make any difference? But we don't know. So what we'll do, we'll go ahead to 2019 uh, and see if uh, Everton are, you know, if these players make Everton any better. After going ahead one year to 2019, we can see Everton came sixth in the league. I thought they would have gone better than that. 62 points, lost 12 games. Um, and only scored 58 goals, 45 against. Let's go to Everton. Marco Silva still in charge. Let's go to players. Messi, Neymar, Alaba and Nua are still there. So, let's go to Messi and see how he performed last season. 36 apps, 14 goals, 7 assists. 10 player of the matches, a rating of 7.89. Absolutely incredible. Neymar, 
let's see how he got on. 38 outs, played every game in the Premier League, 11 goals, not good enough I don't think, 3 assists, 6 man of the matches and a, uh, a rating of 7.60, not too bad. David Alaba, so he played 32 games, no goals, 4 assists, 3 man of the matches and a rating of 727. And last but not least, Manuel Nua. He had 34 outs, 36 conceded, no goals of course, 11 clean sheets, no man of the matches, and only a rating of 6.99. Not very good. Let's go back to the Premier Division. Go to awards winner. Football of the year was uh, Leroy Sane. Golden Glove was Alison Becker, so it wasn't Manuel Neuer. Ah, there you go. Lionel Messi won the Players Player of the Year for Everton. I'm not surprised with a rating of 7.89. Players Team of the Year was Liverpool with Messi in that squad. Players Young Player, Leroy Sane. Okay, and the top goal scorer was Sergio Guerrero again, none of our players in the uh, in any of that really. Um, let's go back to Everton. Let's go to their schedule for last season, see if they did actually win anything. Um, let's have a look. Kind of a couple of seemed to do well. Fourth round of that, quarter final they went out to Tottenham, uh, and they went out in the fifth round of the FA Cup. So they didn't win anything last season so with four of the best players in the uh, in the world really uh, for value reasons uh, they the only decent thing they did was come better than the previous season which was sixth and if you go back to 2013 2014 they came fifth and ever since then they've come 11th 11th 7th 8th and 6th so did they have a little bit of sway on that? Well, we don't know. Again, it was it was an experiment to see if it did make any difference to the Evans squad, and it didn't. Was it the players around them that had an influence on that? Um, did they bring anyone else in? Uh, no, for them, obviously, I, these are me that transferred them over, um, but they did sell some players, uh, which you would have thought these guys would have stayed because of these. Did they go because of them, though? Um, we won't know. Ba Baines went, Keane went, uh, Jay Aker went, Kinsella went. A lot of players uh, did go, as you can see. 23 million, to be exact. Uh, perhaps they had to sell all them players to pay the wages of these four. Uh, which I just want to go and have a look at. Um, we can't, I can do that. Let's go to contract wages. See, uh, Messi's on 1.3 million a week, Neymar's on 700,000 a week, Nua is on 300 grand a week, and Alaba is on 210 grand a week. So you can sort of see why uh, they had to sell a few players to pay that money off. So there you have it. Uh, that was the four best players in one team. Uh, for this Football Manager 2019 experiment. Please like, share and don't forget to press that button which says subscribe. Thanks for watching guys and see you next time.